Hey guys and welcome to Feywood. Uh, for those of you who are new here and are thinking what the frig is this Feywood? Why am I here? I didn't ask to come here. This is craziness. What is this malarkey? Let me just show you what Feywood is. So some of you already know this, but um, Feywood is the name we gave to our house. Uh, and this is the sign I created for that, uh, which looks like it's got a little spider making up a home right there. I'll have to give that a clean, but yeah. So that's Feywood. So anyway, I thought I'd just mention that for anyone who's new and is like, wondering about where Feywood came from and maybe just didn't catch that video or were watching way back when I was craft nerd and going who the hell's this imposter and why is she saying welcome to this Feywood um, but anyway I'm gonna do a really um, super glamorous video for Feywood and uh, you know really bougie really amazing um, and unbox a Nana table. Uh, you might be wondering what the hell is a nana table? Well, let me show you. Alright, so this isn't a nana table. <laughs> but if anyone is watching who watches, you know, any of my beading videos, this is the tray that I was using. It's like literally just a piece of MDF. Um, with a couple of little feet on it. My husband just whipped it up for me to use and you can see it's been well used and well loved. Um, sorry for the noise of my dishwasher in the background. Uh, hopefully that is not too loud. Yeah, so anyway, it was really time to upgrade and or just even just replace this thing. And at first I was asking my husband if he could just make another one of these for me that was clean <laughs> so I can do videos with a clean board uh, and then we started thinking about whether that was the best option especially for filming and then decided oh hang on maybe we could get one of those like little hospital bed tables or as I like to call them nano tables uh, that I can sit down on the couch and you know pull across me and do beadwork or eat TV dinners at, you know, five o'clock in the afternoon. Um, either way. <laughs> um, yeah, my husband's thinking it's quite sexy and it's probably just the first step in a slide down to nanahood. So you guys can just call me Nana Faye. Uh, but anyway, let's unbox this thing and see if it lives up to the previous beadboard. Um, and all the projects that will ensue. All right, I've got my trusty little scissors and I'm just gonna unbox this and we'll see what we have. So I'm going to have to put this thing together, hopefully it all goes smoothly. Um, by the way, I bought this on eBay and the price was I think $135-ish, I'll put the price on the screen, um, with free delivery and it all came nice and quickly. There was some slight miscommunication because I was getting... Um, text notifications about somebody else's order but I cleared all that up and it was fine and it was it came and it was all good so I'll put this together anyway and um, let's see what we've got
Oh god, there's no instructions. I'm hoping this is really straightforward because I don't know what to do now. <laughs> ah. You definitely need a Phillips head screwdriver to put this together. Uh, I've got to say this is a lot of work for a Nana though. You know, Nana Faye, she's getting pretty tired doing this. I'm going to try and tighten this up a bit more and we'll see how we go. But yeah, I might need a, a Nana nap. I've just realized I've put the washers in the wrong place and now I've got to undo what I just did and redo it. No! <laughs> All right, this is why you need instructions because like simple folk like myself do shit like this. No! <laughs> Go in there you silly piece of... Oh my god. <sighs> I've got these little washer things and I've worked out where they're meant to go and they're meant to like get squeezed in between these two bits of metal and it ain't working. And I'm about to spit the dummy. Alright, I'm doing this my way. I can't get that in. It's just gonna have to live without it. We'll just have to hope that I can make this stable. Am I done yet? Can I have a sleep now? Does this look like a table yet? Oh my god, I put the wheels on the wrong spots. I've got to change them now because the ones that lock should be on the outside and I've put one on the outside and one on the inside like a stupid duffer. So let me fix that. Alright, so yeah, locking should be on this side and this side should not be locking because these will go under the uh, couch, bed, whatever it is you're using it for. So I need to switch these two around. Why is it? Yay! I have a table! Think of all the nano adventures I can have with my little TV table. All right, now let's see how she works in place. Fizzy, Nana Faye needs to sit down now. Fizzy, can I sit there please? Huh? 
Can I sit there, please? Do you want to sit with me with my Nana table? Nana Fizz Gig with Nana Faye. Let's see. You're kind of in the way there. You kind of are. What do you think of my table? What do you think, guys? I think this will work out perfectly. And it's got these little ridge things so things can't go flying. What do you think, Fizzy? Oh, yeah. That works out pretty well. I'd probably even lower it a little bit more, I think. What this means for you guys is when I film or I'm doing beadwork, you won't see the camera rocking quite so much because this is nice and solid and not sitting on my legs. So I think that'll work out well. And it's bigger than my um, previous little bead board. It's got these little ridge things so things can't go too haywire, like fly right off too easily. Yeah, I think this is going to work out pretty good. Now, what to do with my table first? Should I knit a rug, eat a super early TV dinner on it, wag my little uh, walking stick at the whippersnappers while having a nice cold beverage? The options are endless. I don't know where to start. You come to check out the table. You don't know what, what the hell this is, do you? Like, what, what has Mama grown out from her legs? This big flat object that means I can't cuddle. You're going to sit on my feet now. I'm stuck here. Alright, my lovelies. Thank you for tuning in to Beading with the Elderly. This is Nana Faye signing off from Faywood. Bye guys.